Another cold case had been solved, thanks to the wonders of DNA evidence. Back in 1977, a 24-year-old mother of one went out with a few friends to the Lions Day Bar in California. Everyone was having a great time, and Jeanne decided to step outside and said that she would be back in 10 minutes. But she never came back. One day later, the woman was found dead, crammed into the backseat of her Volkswagen Beetle car. She was strangled to death with the long sleeve of a woman's dress shirt. This was collected as evidence together with a pack of cigarettes that was also found on the scene, which was later found out to have fingerprints that were not matched to the victim. The investigators even managed to get a sketch of the man Jeanne had left the bar with the night before, but they never managed to arrest anyone. At least not until 2024. This is when the investigators decided to run the fingerprints through the database one last time, and they finally got a match. This was of 69-year-old Willie Eugene Sims, and after collecting more DNA from this man and running it with all the evidence found on the shirt as well as under Janet's fingernails, there was no doubt that Sims was the killer, and he was arrested straight away. He now faces 25 years in prison. Sims was just 21 years old when he killed Janet. He was in the army and assigned to Fort Ord, which was about 70 miles away from San Jose. His old sketch even still resembled his appearance now. And just a year after killing Janet, he was sentenced to a four year in prison for assault to commit murder and robbery using a knife. Janet Sons, who was just six years old at the time, thought that her case was no longer being investigated. But when he heard the news, he was immensely happy, saying that this just came in time for his 55th birthday and the Mother's Day. And that his whole life, he didn't even know what Mother's Day even meant. 